welcome to my youtube channel lifestyle tutorials my tutorial today i'm uh, showing how to resolve cash that has been held on our paypal account we will be moving this transaction that is on hold to, uh, to available balance what happened to my client i delivered some paperwork for them then uh, they just paid paid me pay, paid me out of my invoice they just uh, sent cash to me and once they send send cash to me we never put the uh, tracking information or anything but uh, i've just updated the status the status to to since the order is complete what we'll be doing is that we want to resolve we want i want to show you how to avoid to avoid a cash being being held so to avoid cash being held the first very thing that you should do is to draft the client an invoice send them an invoice a very detailed invoice in my description link i will uh, have a tutorial how to create a how to create an invoice so the very first thing that you need to avoid uh, cash being held on 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 uh, cash being on coming on hold ensure you draft the client an invoice send them an invoice that has the notes of what you are doing and send them the terms and condition maybe no refund no recharge revision is free any issue will, will be settled amicably maybe our whatsapp chat are the evidence that we can we can use we once you are you're able to draft the client the the invoice you the that is the step now bound to ensure that you that cash will not be held Second, secondly ensure you come and uh, and uh, and update the uh, uh, update the update the status the, the status of the tra the transaction so once once we come to to the to transaction we'll we'll be able to 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 press either 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 for because it was a service we cannot say shipped we'll say that the order has been processed we'll add the tra the tracking number we don't have any any tracking information is not required surely we don't require tracking information you'll just be able to submit so entering the tracking information the information ensures that that one on one one on one that 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 uh, we we have provided enough enough information to avoid our people holding our our hull holding our our, our our cash so the other thing that we we need to do to do to ensure that that the, that the cash we will not will not go to will not will not uh, the cash will not will not go on hold as uh, this transaction is uh, we can resolve once we say uh, i have officially sent the client another invoice but meanwhile what i'll be doing i'll be refunding i'll be refunding this transaction so to for, for me to refund i'll just come here and issue uh, click issue refund and the client will 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 uh, that transaction will be sent back to the client then my buyer will be able to pay officially through my invoice to avoid chargeback or to avoid any dispute because uh, what the reason that this transaction is not going through is that the client provided very little notes notes explaining about what happened why they sent me that cash ensure you watch my youtube channel in case you are your cash has been held on you or temporarily limited ensure you get me through my youtube channel lifestyle tutorials or my official gmail njogu karongwa gmail also you have a you go in my newest video you'll get my whatsapp more whatsapp number in the description link this the tutorial was about how to avoid cash being held a transaction where you find a client has paid for a transaction but the cash has been held for by people till you till you provide more details thank you for sticking with me to the end of the video recording thank you